All right, Roxy, thank you so much for that. Time is 536. And something to be mindful of this morning on your early commute. When the roads get wet due to rainfall and the temperatures are cold, they will inevitably get icy and create dangerous driving conditions. KTSM 9 News reporter Jasmine Perry is live out at Trans Mountain. Jasmine, good morning. We were seeing that snow falling last night. What is it looking like out there this morning? Yes, good morning, Brenda. It is still so cold out here. I am shivering, but as Carla reported last night, there was flurries out here. It's not snowing yet, but I do suggest the viewers when they're heading out to please leave on time to avoid any accidents on the roads if the roads do get icy later today. This especially on overpasses here in El Paso and Trans Mountain, which is especially prone to become iced over. Tech stop crews have been working to put brine and salt on the pavement to prevent loss of traction for drivers. And while driving, it is important to lower speed during inclement weather. Give space in between you and other drivers. Several local school districts are delaying classes today due to the inclement weather. Here is a list of the school districts that will be on a two hour delay. Some of them are El Paso, Socorro, Isleta, Canutillo, ISD. Fort Bliss is also under delay. Start with non essential personal reporting by 10 a.m. Now, if you are ready to head out this morning to go to work or if you're heading out to college for anything, um, like I said, yes, schools are going to be delayed, but make sure to leave on time and Roxy will keep us updated throughout the newscast with these weather conditions. Reporting in Trans Mountain, I'm Jasmine Perry, KTSM 9 News.